forecast now? <laughs> I can give you Connecticut. <laughs> I don't know if I can give you the universe. Uh, it's going to be dark in the universe. <laughs> there you go. And Mercury is out of retrograde. And Mercury right? is out of retrograde. Thank <laughs> goodness gracious. 515. All right, let's take a look at what's normal. 19, typical overnight low. We're doing a little bit better than that. 37, the normal high. Can you believe it can get down as cold as 15 below zero? That was back in 1934, 58, 1990. Guys, believe it or not, we're going to be dealing with the possibility of record-breaking warmth on Saturday. Yeah, Saturday the temperatures might make it into the mid 50s wow. here in Connecticut. That, that is so good. That's Saturday. How awesome is that? And then Sunday the temperatures come crashing down, and there could be a little light snow around on Sunday. We'll get to that in just a minute. In the meantime, our Doppler scans have stayed dry. Good morning. Visibility is at 10. Hello, it's clear and it's cold to start. Temperatures are in the upper teens, low to mid to upper 20s. 19, typical overnight low. We've got that in Salisbury for you, but everybody else is doing generally better than that. 30 in Groton, 32 in New Haven. And the temperature differential, as Wendell was mentioning a little bit earlier, it is down. It is down from where we were 24 hours ago. 13 degrees cooler in Meriden. So just keep in mind, it is a little bit colder than yesterday at this time. All right, the winds are fairly calm with the exception of the shoreline. We've got a five to seven mile an hour breeze. That'll knock the temperatures down there a little bit. Even 18 at Bradley. So you got to dress for the upper teens, low to mid 20s this morning. ICAMS across the state, New Haven looking good. Very little snow left on that New Haven green. And you've got the stars are in the sky in Waterbury, 25 degrees there. That's pretty good. We'll take it to New London right now, 30 in New London. That's an awesome looking eye cam in Middletown. Good morning to you. Things are looking good there. All right, numbers in from our weather watchers. 15 in Colebrook is the coldest number I can find in the state right now. 23 to 26 in North Granby and Salem. Good morning to Sharon, it's 21 degrees, 27 in Naugatuck, 22 in Staffordville. So the numbers are doing okay, better than average, which is good news. Mostly sunny skies during the day today. You're gonna to see abundant sunshine. Look at this, not a cloud out there. 42 degrees by 3 p.m. We might be a degree or two cooler along the shoreline, but still topping out in the low 40s with abundant sunshine and clear skies tonight. Now those skies are going to change over to mostly cloudy skies by late this evening through early tomorrow morning. And we're expecting a brief rain or a snow shower tomorrow morning. Our satellite and radar scans the state dry. Let's take a look at future cast tomorrow's weather today. 1 p.m. abundant sunshine, 5 p.m. abundant sunshine, even clear through midnight. But then here comes this little wave of moisture. This is very early tomorrow morning. It'll bring maybe a rain shower, maybe a couple of snowflakes to the state around 6 a.m. You'll notice it's very isolated in nature. And then tomorrow we get back to the partial sunshine. Today's daytime highs climb into the low 40s. Abundant sunshine. Can I say that enough? Abundant sunshine? I, I haven't heard I'm, I'm going to say it again. Abundant sunshine. Uh, and then your overnight lows tonight dropping to about 30. Not bad. Above average. 48 tomorrow with a chance for a rain or snow shower in the morning. Partial clearing in the afternoon. 48 tomorrow. Yes, we're going to be flirting with the 50 degree mark. Friday, a little bit cooler. 44. And then Saturday, there's that 53 degree temperature. 54 is the record set back in 1999. If we get to 54, we will tie a record. 31 though on Sunday, we might have to adjust that Sunday forecast to include a little bit of snow. Uh, as the storm system gets very close to Connecticut, it might be throwing a little bit of snow into the forecast for Sunday, but we'll continue to fine tune that forecast. It's still Wednesday and we're talking about a storm system for Sunday. 